Okay, I think we're all set. We're gonna make some progress today. <laughs> Story progress, I mean. So we haven't done in like a week. <laughs> But yeah, we're going to actually uh, see if we can go meet up with uh, the Zora people. Right through some uh, shrines along the way. Uh, only got like an hour and a half time. So not like a lot of stuff for today, but it'll be fine. It's not like I haven't already put like 100 hours into this game. <laughs> Yes, you will notice that I am wearing two shields. <laughs> uh, it was an accident. <laughs> That's fine, it happens. Where's your Korok friend, huh? Ugh. It's bad you can't fuse them to a shield. <laughs> Uh, actually. You can't pick them up directly. Because of course. Why would you be able to? Oh, that went smoother than I thought it would. You may get there completely unmolested. <laughs> nah, we'll, we'll uh, give you a little trouble. No one's allowed to get off scot free. Also, the shrine may be up here. Yeah, hope everybody's doing good. It is Monday, the start of another week. Ugh. <laughs> um, I uh, gained new clients. Uh, at the beginning of the month, and uh, as such, uh, they don't, you know, they're, they're not, like, fully assimilated into my, uh, into my routine. So, naturally, I gotta do that. And, god, it's been, like, a year or so since I've had to do that. <laughs> it sucks so hard. <laughs> uh, I forgot completely, like, how boring it is. Six more that I have to do. So it's nearby but below. If you didn't know, somehow, uh, whenever there's a cave entrance, there's usually one of those uh, bloopies around, and 
if you scare them away, or if, you know, come up too close to them, they'll run directly towards the entrance to the, uh, to the cave. I'll be you, uh, no getting it. It can be kind of helpful because sometimes the caves are a little difficult to find. I'm not sure if I have never seen that one. I'm gonna say that I think that I have. I'll take my shield shield back, thank you. boy I was talking to uh, a co-worker about games that we're playing <laughs> and he was saying it's like well I've been playing um, I'm playing uh, the new Star Wars game and I'm like oh yeah yeah, yeah I played that and then I abandoned it. <laughs> I said, I've abandoned every game for Zelda at this point. It's amazing that I realize that other games exist. So polite. not supposed to be there. Yeah, forget about me. <laughs> I feel like I got away with a lot in this particular instance.
Alright, well, I'll just use this one. Amber. I need so much amber. Yep. Problem is, I still have not found the uh, shrine. Though, it's likely it could be up there. Alright, we'll, we'll keep going up. I should probably check out what this guy's up to first, huh? Let me out! I wasn't begging for food. <laughs> I have plenty. Alright, let's, let's, let's keep going up. And lo, there is more. I want to call it Mookie's Shrine. Yeah, I loved how politely those uh, goblins were just sitting there in front of their boss. <laughs> it was like they were actually giving him respect. <laughs> like some Yakuza family meeting. There's still a little bit more up here, though, but I think that's enemies, because it's, like, inside the skull top. I was right that it was inside the skull top, but not necessarily what I was expecting to find, huh? Hmm. Okay. Cool. Well, moving on. I like this guy's color. Pen for you.
Um, what happened to the weapon that I was carrying? <laughs> There we go. All better. What is this thick monkey gunk anyway? Ugh, those stones that are blocking the road. This isn't good. Many travelers turn back, of course. They wouldn't they would they would in a situation like this. If you're not a bird or a fish, you have to follow this path to get to Zora's domain. Sometimes all you can do is give up, but I have to get there. Mm. Finley is waiting for me at Zora's domain. This calls for... The water spout. I need to build um, maybe some sort of little vehicle that I might be able to use to, to drive around and spray water. What would be better? I'll try this first. Wait, 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 wait. I should have known better. <laughs> Do it from the single. Okay. 
Good enough. Maybe I need one more piece. I was going to say, I have to have a stabilizer. It's almost too fast. <laughs> it's almost too quick. I won't even be able to take it with me. Just with the fun way.
glad that that stuff doesn't, like, damage me. At least I don't think it will. Da -da -da -da. I certainly got mucked up. While you're holding something, you can just like walk up walls. <laughs> I mean, not exactly, but it's still pretty good. Yeah. Oh, my tool! I thought it was an octagon, in all honesty. Speaking of... Yeah, I, I do kind of wish that you could make a follow me drone. That'd be really nice. Don't mind me just washing them out. to have a weapon that's fine just use your weapon their weapon with yours and take it 
I send up with a. Came something in the bottom, right? some uh, frame rate issues here. a pretty good spear. I'd much rather have that over the sword. Oh, that's new. It's kind of got an interesting look to it. Come on. I mean, that I can't take... <laughs> I can't take a picture of it because I'm too close to the treasure chest. just multiple ways into the cave. Let's get something that I can hit this with.
I'm actually hoping for amber. <laughs> Got one. I actually need sticky frogs. another that's a it's an emoji dump I will gladly take this what's the good word today There's a shrine somewhere near here, right? <laughs> I sworn there was at least. That's fine. We'll, we'll keep on. We'll keep on following the path. This gross, disgusting, oily path. Just streaming? Oh, that's fine. Hope it's going well for you. I finally decided that it was time to uh, actually go take a look at what's going on with the fish people. Maybe see if I can help. <laughs> Otherwise, I'm going to continually be, be finding things that I can do to procrastinate um, my finishing of the game. I was telling somebody that I work with today that, like, I, I could finish the game. But if I finish the game, then I wouldn't be able to play the game. <laughs> so I'm like, well... Well, it's I mean, of course like if I want to play the game, I can play the game, but it's just like why would I want to finish it? I can keep playing it. His little bulb thing is covered in uh, rock, too. You literally have no choice but to hit him with like a bomb or a rock or some shit like that. like the grossest enemy. <laughs> That's borderline okay. And I will take it over top of the uh, the shield shield.
Kind of interesting how Zoro's domain fell again to the to the to the Liz Alphos. Seafood. Yeah, any uh any new luck on your on your job search? Fine, keep going. We'll figure out one out soon. <laughs> Dude, how are you guys not dead? <laughs> Actually, you know what? I'll use this. This will be good. Oh my fucking god, why did you throw that? Where's the white one? Oh, you're down there. Yeah, no worries. As, if I remember, I'll try. <laughs> I don't. I don't always remember everything, but um, if it's fresh in my mind, I try to. You'll have to let me know if you actually do get lucky. Because it'd be, it'd be nice to hear. Yeah. Come back. Come back. You can do it. I think he's... Trying to find another way. <laughs> uh, he got lost. He didn't stay there. Uh, this rock is not going to make things easier. That's fine. Good deal. It would have been just easier to fly right into the middle of the city, wouldn't it? This is also giving me, like, big, um... Mario Sunshine vibes. You like hit them so hard that they fly off the bridge. That'd be pretty cool. 
I mean, those little guys are actually doing work. Nice. I gotta pick up these before they hit them and explode. He's sort of a fish at the end of it. Why? Why do they do that? What? What good is having a fish attached to your sword gonna do for you? Uh, should I continue finish or continue following the path? Uh, we can just take a shortcut. I wonder if uh, the falling blob would like take you out of the sky if you got hit by it. That actually could be kind of funny. <laughs> I still have yet to been uh, to have been hit by the um, the falling rocks. Water is also like a gross color too. Hmm. <laughs> Zora's domain is just shit stained. <laughs> this first. Wait, it looks like there's some clean water, but the rest of it's all sludgy. Gross. The power of water. Battery here. Let's just go ahead and bew, bew, bew. Huck. 
I'm only seeing those two. to know. Right, now that this is charged. Come on. Right, can I get in the water over here? Yes. This would so totally not be possible, though, right? Like, that entire water would be electrified. She fills pretty quickly. Now I got a warp point in Zora's domain, so I don't have to run here all the time. But it it's pretty easy to get here. I just jump off of Sky Island. Excuse me. That vile sludge. <clears throat> I'm so sorry. <clears throat> Excuse me. Everyone has been treated now, but we have we've used up all of the splash fruit. There were more injuries than anticipated. Please accept my apology. You have nothing to apologize for. You did you did what had to be done. Most importantly, I'm grateful that everyone is all right. Now, if we could only do something about that statue. Hmm? You there, are you traveler? I'm sorry uh, that I did not notice you until now. I was focused on a matter of great importance. <clears throat> Who's this green fish girl? Zora's domain is in troubled times. At present, due to the sludge falling from the sky. Things have finally calmed down here, at least for the moment. However, this place remains covered in sludge. Such a shame, as this particular statue is uh, so incredibly important to the Zora of the Domain. Hmm. We were just discussing how we need to wash away the sludge. I apologize that I cannot provide a great deal of hospitality. Please do make yourself at home. Gotcha. You think that they would like it? Oh. 
it's interesting. The, the music, it sound, it, it has like that Zora Domain sound to it, but it's uh, slightly turned. Is that me? Whoa. Me riding Sidon? A sludge! I see you managed to wash it away. That statue is a symbol of hope for the, for the Zora. It is very precious to us. Thank you so much for cleaning it up. In truth, that statue depicts the, the majestic forms of the pair who saved this cherished domain in the past. <laughs> that is right. Beloved Prince Sidon of Zora and his very best friend, Sir Link! The heroic Hillian swordsman. It is simply wonderful, is it not? How oh, I would love to meet him someday. Say, you have similar uh, stature to the Hillian hero. Similar eyes as well. Oh my, and you're also a Hillian. And a swordsman! Wait, could it be? Are you Link? The swordsman of legend? <laughs> Please rem remember to mind your manners, Chroma. Chroma. That's a cool name. Oh, um, please accept my apology. Yes, pardon our rudeness. I am quite surprised to learn that you are the legendary swordsman, Sir Link. I have heard mention of you nearly every day since I first arrived at this domain. I am Prince Sidon's... Oh, forgive me. I am your best friend's fiancé. My name is Yona. I'm truly honored to have the opportunity to meet you, Sir Link. I heard that you were missing along with Princess Zelda. If I may ask, what brings you here? To think that such a thing took place beneath Hyrule Castle, and now you're traveling the kingdom to investigate? So you search for Princess your search for Princess Zelda is what brought you to this domain. In that case, feel free to investigate the area around the domain as thoroughly as you see fit. Oh, I have a lovely idea. If you do not mind, I ask that you please go and meet with Sidon. I'm certain that he would be delighted to see you. Sidon can be found at Mitha Court, located at the peak of Polymus Mountain. Oh. Lady Yona, it is time. I fear we must be going now. Forgive me, Sir Link, but I must be on my way. If it pleases you. After you've met with Sinon, perhaps you can visit me at the infirm infirmary on the floor above. I am determined to be of assistance to you as best I can, Sir Link. I like the uh, pink and purple along with her color palette. They stand here looking like the fucking Grim Reaper. Yeah, it's a nice design. Everyone's got wonderful designs. I love it. Do some cooking. Rest at the inn that I never rested at. Ah, the room that used to hold. Shrine. Hillian footsteps. <laughs> yeah. Wait, have you already spoken with Lady Yona? She's attempting to repair your Zora armor. You know full well that the Zora 
armor allows even a Hillian like you to climb the waterfalls. It's essential if you hope to travel these parts with ease. Lady Yona's infirmary. I suggest you confer with her at once. Wait, is Sidon changing the text on these things? Oh. Oh. Hmm. Ancient Arwana. Yeah, here you go. Whoa. I'd love to have another armor hmm. set. Yes, yes. is actually much appreciated. I wonder how up towards the top I can go. Blood Moon and say I got pretty far. very much today. I'm glad to see that there are still uh, Koroks up here. Bye-bye! So, can I get over, over there? I can't sign some time off the travel at least. Does the one part on its own allow me to do this? I wonder.
<laughs> Easy picking. Okay. Um Nice. I could have actually used that froggy suit, couldn't I? Oh, also actually pretty nice. I actually have two two pieces now. <laughs> Like it's a climbing shirt, it's a climbing hat and shirt or something like that. <clears throat> Maybe. I, I could be wrong. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I don't know. I, I should trust myself a little bit better than that. I think Naborimas is like, I'm going to climb. But not like the actual like act of climbing in the boite. The thing I probably could have taken the waterfall.
I know exactly what I should be wearing when I need a uh, side on. This statue get moved from the uh, city. Uh -huh. I was wondering who might be who that might be, and it turns out to be none other than Link. Look, do you know how much Polymus Mountain has changed? It now enshrines a glorious statue of Mipha. She looks after the Zora from here, just like she always did. The reason we can endure this sludge is because of everyone's efforts, and also thanks to her kind protection. Wait, was it the side on up here? I wish you could like belly slide down this. <laughs> Hey there, big fish boy. the coach's whistle. <laughs> Link has been far too long. I received word that you had gone missing and was beside myself with concern. Whatever could have transpired. To think no. something like that could have taken place beneath Hyrule Castle. And afterward, you mysteriously awoke on a sky island. The sky... Mm. Could it be that the sky is the key to everything after all? Ah, my apologies. Yeah. I have actually been wondering if those floating sky islands could be the source of the falling sludge. That is why I have tasked a Zora, a Zora historian with investigating rune fragments and all historical documents related to the sky. As for me, I am not at liberty to, to leave this spot at present. I, as I am uniquely qualified to deal with the sludge here, you see, old friend, this place is the source of the water that flows into Zora's domain. That is why I must use your, my power of water manipulation to separate the sludge from our water in order to clean it. If I cease, then the sullied water will flow into our beloved home, and there will be much pain and suffering. Say, Link... Does it not seem that Princess Zelda's whereabouts might be related to the floating skylands and the, and the ruins? If so, perhaps you should go and speak with her, our historian, Gia uh, Giato. His many years have blessed him with great wisdom. 
It is quite possible that he could provide you with some useful information. At present, you should be able to find uh, Giato continuing his investigation at Toto Lake. By the way, I hope you know that I am truly happy to see you again after such a long time apart, my dearest friend. Visit me anytime you like. Your presence is never anything less than welcome and, and appreciated. Hmm. I mean, there's no ill effect. I just wanted to see if I could just get, like, completely slugged. <laughs> Alright. Lady Yona, Yona, yes, she is my dearest childhood companion, and much more. She is also my fiancé, my intended, my bride-to-be. There was a time when we saw each other often, but life got in the way, as it does. Time has certainly gotten away from us. I recall our childhood days with utmost fondness, and at last she has come to visit for the first time in a while, and yet I must admit that I... I have been a tad awkward around her due to the situation at hand. We have barely spoken since she arrived. She's been immense help in uh, easing our struggle here. I am so grateful for her kindness. Link is brutal being unable to help you with your investigation. Still, please do let me know if I can make any if you make any headway. Okay, so Tota Lake. Or Toto. Toto Lake. Whatever, run away, that's fine. Coward. Oh, holy fuck, what you. What you hit me with? <laughs> he was not green. He was definitely not green.
damn. I can't kill him. <laughs> Damn, you gotta be kidding me. Actually, I may be able to kill him. Concerned. Now I'm concerned. Jesus fucking Christ, I was dumb. <laughs> And it only takes one uh, armor piece to be able to swim up a mountain, so that's pretty fucking good. Slate is broken, Link must find. I see it. Hey, I am required to remove the sludge. This the stone slate. I can hardly believe my eyes. Link, I must thank you. Oh, incredible. Ah! I can finally read it. Yes, I can very well. Stand upon the land of the skyfish, and behold its lofty view. 
Among the floating rocks you see, a droplet waits for you. Through this droplet, shoot an arrow with the mark of the king. Do this task and you shall reveal a most wondrous thing. See the watery bridge's resting spot with your own two eyes, that which connects the Zora to the people of the skies. This is an extraordinary discovery. Uh, this important text actually tells us how to journey to the sky. Although in truth, that mystery just leads us to straight into another straight answer. One difficult ha one difficulty has to be has been overcome, and yet another has appeared in its wake. As it mentions the mark of the king, perhaps it'd be prudent to consult King Dorfin. I assume that he'll be returning from his investigation on the sludge shortly. Okay, so we talk to the king. Well, I can only imagine one place where the king would be. Hey, you restart. Oh. 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 King Dorfin, Super Punch, and Super Kick. Yeah! There's no other choice. I'll have to hide in the secret spot. And that spot is... Hmm? What's up, guy? We're full up on folks who are allowed to play our King Dorfin game. We can't keep playing with you here, so take the hint and scram. My king, King Dorfin. I'm pretty pleased. Um, oh, what if you went to that one place to hide? Hey, come, come on, do it right. That didn't sound like him at all. I'm trying, but I can't play Muzu and the monster all by myself. Hey, I've been worried forever. The secret spot where King Dorfin is hiding. What kind of place is it? I know, right? I asked King Dorfin about it once. He said it was a uh, pristine sanct <laughs> sanctum or something. Christine Sanctum. Eh? So I guess it's a spot with clear water. Somewhere where you can get your tummy clean. <clears throat> but these days, most of the water around the domain is all yucky because of the sludge. Oh, oh! I heard there's some clean water flowing somewhere between uh, Polemus Mountain and the domain. 
And there's supposed to be a secret entrance behind the waterfall, too. How cool is that? Secret entrance behind a waterfall with clean water? Hmm. That sounds pretty amazing. Muzu told us we could never, ever tell anyone. It's fine. No one's listening. Anyway, let's go through our game again. This time with feeling. <clears throat> Can we play something else? <laughs> I now know your secret. It has to be like there. Help if I went towards the uh, right waterfall. But I've been here. Pristine Sanctum. There was an entrance down there. Hm. Oh, he doesn't look good at all. Uh, who approaches? Is it you? So it is Link. Hmm? You find this place. What cruel ploy are you plotting? Hold on, my ever-loyal Muzu. If you speak in such a way without explanation, Link will, here will only be confused as to what's going on. Oh, Link. It has been some time since we last spoke. I had received word that you went missing along with Princess Zelda. Why have you come here? Well, well... I think that such a thing would transpire for the hero of Hyrule and Princess Zelda. Huh? You expect us to believe that Princess Zelda simply disappeared? Just like that? Do not sully your ears with your lies. I saw Princess Zelda with my own eyes right after the phenomenon at Hyrule Castle took place. Calm yourself, hmm. Muzu. Muzu. Link's eyes betray no hint of deception. He remains a trusted friend of the Zora. 
There must be an explanation. Link, I will now tell you what happened when we last saw Princess Zelda, as well as the reason behind my seclusion here at the Pristine Sanctum. We encountered Princess Zelda just after Hyrule Castle ascended into the sky. Floating islands appeared as if from nowhere. Sludge and fragments of the ruins began raining down. Muzu and I had left the domain to investigate these strange occurrences. That is when it happened. Princess Zelda descended from the sky, accompanied by a sludge monster. What happened next took us by surprise. She then unleashed the beast upon us. <sighs> King Dorfin valiantly vanquished the threat. However, he was gravely injured uh, by the sludge during the battle. As for Princess Zelda, she vanished without a trace. If word got out that Princess Zelda lost her mind and harmed King Lazora King, the resulting turmoil would be devastating. That is why we are temporarily remaining hidden within the pristine sanctum. According to your story, Princess Zelda disappeared suddenly in the depths beneath Hyrule Castle. On the other hand, she suddenly appeared near Dor Zora's domain and unleashed a monster upon us. The waters of truth have become murkier still. But from the Zora perspective, one thing is clear. It all leads back to the sky. This disaster, the sludge, the monster, and even Princess Zelda. It may well be that the answer to these riddles can only be found skyward. Like a sword. Sidon ordered Giatto, a historian well acquainted with the ruins to investigate. I wonder if any progress has been made. Ah, so you've already spoken with Giatto. Uh, you say that the Mark of the King was mentioned on the stone slate that was restored. Hmm, indeed. I do know of it. The Mark of the King refers to a Zora King scale. One of my scales, in other words. I have heard it called by the name you mentioned in an ancient ritual, however. None remain who know how it was used. If this particular scale of mine may prove useful to you, by all means, take a few. There's no need to, for restraint. This is as... This is, is nothing to me. If you run out, simply return and inquire more. <laughs> oh? After all that has transpired and after much reflection, I've come to a realization. I must truly be getting on in years to have allowed a mere monster to catch me off guard. Perhaps the time is nearing for me to pass the title of, of King onto Sidon. King Dorovan! In any case... That is a matter for another day. After the chaos sur surrounding the sludge has quieted her. Please inform Sidon about my situation and about the king's scale. Tell him there is no need to worry about me. Tell him that he must go forth and do what needs to be done. So it seems that he can sense them nearby. So there, uh, there be no fool in the king. It's actually kind of funny. I enjoy the fact that they uh, actually made that so. Here's it if you hit the waterfall with the uh, sailcloth open, it just automatically does the thing. Uppies are still uppies.
The only remaining mystery is that of the land of the skyfish and the floating rock in the shape of a droplet. Stand on, upon the land of the skyfish. That must be referring to an actual location of some sort. I'm sure that if we locate the land of the skyfish, it'll lead us to the floating rock in the shape of a droplet. Link, if you have any leads, please let me know at once. I think that I... Need to go to the sky. Because what do you. What, what, what is this? Is it a thing in the shape of a fish? But I really have no way of getting there, do I? Because I doubt that this is anywhere near the same level. I'll give it a try. Maybe I'll get lucky. Yeah, that's a no-go. Okay, then we'll get some fire.
This is actually working well. Let it take me as high as it can to give myself the the best chance for getting over there. Although I I doubt that I'll have any trouble doing so at this point. I'm Oh, are we in a gravity bubble? <sighs> Would it feel like cheating if we didn't start like at the beginning? Possibly, but I did legitimately find my way here. Oh. Slow fall. <laughs> anyway, that's fine. We're going to do the shrine, and then we're actually going to call it, because I'm hungry, and it's late. And like I said, I started, I started late today. But at least now we'll have a starting point. Orbs of water. Wait, 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 wait. What? What? I'm not ready to use that yet. I know how it wants me to do it. I'm just hoping that I can get away with it. not. Why would that work? I understand now. I understood, but I still failed. It's 
Orbs are weird. I really like them, but they're weird. Carry a lot of momentum with those things. Oh fuck. Fucking lost. I can tell that those things are going to get me killed. <laughs> just just speaking from the heart here. Those things are totally going to get me killed. But I'm kind of okay with it. I am I, <laughs> I am down for the experiment that will be uh, water bubbles and low gravity. Uh, th oh, there it is. Same as we're here. I'll, I'll do one of these real quick. do me for today i really do appreciate you watching if you did and uh i'll be back soon with some more hmm. i really do wonder what those uh water bubbles can do when put in certain situations i'll find out eventually obviously but for right now I think we're good. Okay. I'm 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 getting in that like one more just one more thing mindset. <laughs> I need to stop. Okay. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye for now. <laughs>